And this will be the five o'clock, 1700 flare off. Just how I happened to be stood here when it started. Oh, you got eyes in the back of your head round here. I don't think we're going to get too much off it. In fact, nothing's going to come close to that release we had the other day, I don't think. Still gutted that the uh, video for that is corrupted. Nothing really visible. But you can hear it. That's the distinctive sound of the covered flare stack. After a while you get used to it. And it always pays around here. Uh, Spain and I have got used to carrying a, um, a camera phone at all times. Even if you're just sat outside, you know, chatting to locals, you have one in your pocket for this very reason. Because you never know, you might get a massive burn off. Wind today is in, oh, it's coming in our direction. or slightly over to, uh, to the north east north east by northeast you would call that probably getting this one out of the way before the uh, local constabulary turn up the date I'm at the two minute mark. I'm assuming the more regular the flare offs, the less pressure there'll be. So I guess we're going to be hard pushed to get another one like, uh, like we had a few nights back. grey sky behind us no no uh, decent sunlight behind it we're not getting the uh, or I can't even see any heat haze coming from this stack today for that I'm putting it down to uh, the dullness the constant grey behind the stack All right, it's 3 minutes 25 Coming up on four minutes, a few spots of rain. Oh, pressure's increased a little. hear an audible alarm which has just ceased
5 minutes 15 seconds. Coming up at 6 minutes 30 seconds now. No odour over here as yet, but like I say, the uh, wind is actually going across us. Um, you know, if you have a quick look at that windsock over there, you'll see that it's it's a, it's on a diagonal. Um, so the wind it, the wind will be taking it right towards my tent, which it always does. So we'll have a little wander down there in a minute once this flare finishes, right? And then uh, see if our odour is in place. Um, because we're just going to keep documenting it, we're going to keep phoning it through to the EA and of course the lack of action by the EA will give us a good standing in court when the time's right to uh, expose unlawful behaviour that goes unchecked by these fake government agencies that are there for the environment DECC for climate change, the EA and the local council planning departments, all as far as I'm concerned on the payroll of the corporations. They are government agencies after all, and the government wants this crap on your land. 65% of the country is going to end up with this shit all over it. Even police officers that I've spoken to have said, you know, they're, 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 they're concerned about everywhere they go they're going to see these damn things. Well, pressure's, listen to the sound, picking up. Eight minutes, 55. Yesterday mornings was almost two hours long, I think. Was it the day before yesterday? It was almost two hours long. 5.40 in the morning till 7.40 in the morning. That was a huge, huge release. But they had been inactive here for a, almost a week, so the pressure must have built up and built up and built up to the point where they probably made a call and said, look, we've got to let this go, otherwise we're going to blow up. Another good reason not to be drilling holes in the ground then, isn't it? I view these as needles puncturing the uh, skin and the flesh of the planet. 65% of our country's about to get perforated. Now look, there's a bad guy over there. Bad guy, bad guy, bad guy, look. Having a little peek at us, having a peek at them. Your man up there on the mound, he's lucky, he's downwind of it, or upwind of it. I will get that right one day. 
Okay, we're at the 10 minute mark now. Never mince forty. So right, let's actually take a walk down to the OBS end. I'll leave the camera running because I've got to quit at fifteen minute mark anyway for fast book. So let's take a little walk down, see if we can't pick up an odour and get a better view from the other side. Anyway, this is uh. This is the business end of the stick down here. Oh god, yeah. Oh, the methane is absolutely overpowering here. Overpowering. That is absolutely disgusting. Hi Sandra, it's Joe. Thank you for dinner, first of all, and second of all, you might want to stick your head out your window because it's absolutely reeking here. They're, they're flaring again, uh, and I can't breathe. Yeah, you might want to make that call. They do, but then again, it's kind of handy if it's out of hours because you just log it as a new incident number, and um, you know, you, you know the drill. Like, just put it straight out there. All right, darling. Talk to you soon. Bye bye. <coughs> Right, we're almost at the 15 minute mark. We call it a day. It absolutely reeks here. Reeks to high heaven. Where I'm stood now, in front of the tech tent. Uh, you can see the tech tent there. I'm stood here now. And the air is absolutely foul. Absolutely foul. Yeah, look at him. He's even got his nose covered. Look, yeah, that's Spain. Spain, what's it smell like to you, brother? Oh, it smells fucking horrible. Yeah. High level of gas. Fucking high level of gas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is sick. Get your mask on, mate. Yeah. I'm already poisoned to fuck. Oh, God, that is fucking strong, actually. Oh, right, I'm calling it a day on this because we're, we're at the 15 minute mark. I might be able to get another squeeze another minute or two in before fast but won't let me upload it my god that is bad oh. dirty 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 smell
I mean, it really is rank. You can't, no words can describe how heavy that is in your lungs, in your throat. Everywhere you, you turn, you can't get away from it. It's everywhere. I mean, yeah, look, there's, there's a very clever Spain who is now wearing his protective face mask. But shh, don't tell him, it's only good for particles, it's no good for gas. But it's mind over matter, he thinks it's doing some good. But jeez, it's wet, this is really rank over here. Oh, I wish I'd stayed around the other side now. There, yeah, little flame, little flame, more flames. So you'd think that as they release the pressure, the pressure would drop. But here it is going up. Oh. Oh, it's fucking terrible, isn't it? Ugh, got a puke. And naturally, with the wind going this way, we stood right in its frickin' jet wash again. Come on, mate, switch the fucking thing off. They are getting flames out the top now, but I've seen a lot worse than that. Well, I'm hoping that they're going to stop this within the next two minutes, otherwise I won't be able to upload to um, Facebook. I'll have to do it to YouTube and then link it down. Oh, it really is rank as fuck. Oh, look at that timing. Looks like he's bringing it down. Oh, this stuff can't be good for you. They say it's harmless, but I don't see how. If it's so vile, surely that's your body telling you, get to fuck with it. And at 19 minutes and 5 seconds we're done, hopefully, let's call it a day there. From West Newton and Rufflin's leaky well pad, ta-ta for now. <laughs>